this is Jamie Magrich. Welcome to Jamie's Craft Table. Today I'm going to show you how I made this card. It's using Elegantly Said. Using this stamp, this stamp, and this thank you, and this stamp. I'm using Knight of Navy ink. I have a three and a half by four and a quarter inch piece of white. A three and five eighths by four and seven eighths inch piece of crushed curry. Four and a quarter by five and a half inch piece of Knight of Navy. Five and a half by eight and a half thick white, scored and folded at four and a quarter. Okay. So let's bring in the Knight of Navy piece first. And the Knight of Navy ink. And this stamp here. We're going to stamp the background. So I'm going to start. You want a little bit of it to go off the edge. So I'm going to start here in this corner. And you really only need to do the corner because you're covering up most of the uh, rest of it. So we're going to do all four corners. I love this stamp. This has got to be one of my favorite stamps. get that inked up well enough, but it's all right. And I missed a little bit there, so let's just come in with this little swirl there. And do the same thing over here. bottom corner here. I'm just going to add a little bit something else there. Okay, that looks good. Okay, let's set that aside. Let's bring in our white piece. First thing I'm going to do is stamp this border. It's a lacy piece. a little bit of the edge there so I'm going to wipe that off so I haven't trimmed it yet so I don't want it to transfer onto my card okay so about mm, eighth of an inch quarter inch from the edge I'm just gonna set it down and I think it went a little crooked but we're going to go with it anyway. Yeah, it's a little crooked. It's not too bad though. Well, let's turn it over and try it again and see which one we like better. A little bit closer to the edge. That's better. Okay. Then we're going to take this flower, this one, and we're going to stamp that down here, this bottom. And I forgot, oh, there it is. I thought I forgot to mount the sentiment. The sentiment, thank you. And stamp that right there. Awesome. Now we're going to take this piece we just stamped and mount it on our crushed curry. I'm going to go ahead and use my wet glue. Now 
there's just going to be the, t well, I think it's a sixteenth of an inch. So line up the three edges and then set it down. Okay. And this is going to get dimensionals on the back of it. Let me move this so I don't get ink on it. Turn it over. Some dimensionals. Oh, I got this thing of edges. Let's use that up. Bring in our one that we stamped with the filigree. Center this up on there. There's a quarter of an inch all the way around. Mount that on the front of our card. It's the same size as the front of the card, or it should be. Seems like my card's a little bit larger. This one in because it's handy. I'll go ahead and trim that. Line it up. Yeah, it's just a hair. Trim that blue piece just a hair short, but that's all right. There we go. And then I just added some dots to it. Now these dots are not stamping up. Where'd I put them? Okay. Here we go. These are my from my mind's eye. I think, oh yeah, I bought them a Tuesday morning a while ago. I'm gonna use up some of my stash. And I didn't have any. These, this blue is like almost the right exact color. Look at that. So I'm going to take one of these medium ones. Place it over here. And one of the small ones. Over here. Another small one. Here. There you go, that's our card. It's as simple as that. It's the one I did previously. Well, thank you for joining me today at Jamie's Craft Table. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and I hope you can find a little bit of time to play with some stamps, ink, and paper.